What is up guys? I just got in from the gym. Went by Sam's, picked up a rotisserie chicken, only five bucks. I wasn't gonna go to um, Panda Express, but I was thinking you'd get more food if you just get the chicken. And I already have a cup of rice here, so uh, yeah, it works out. But this video, I wanna show you guys the new bang. We finally got it here on the island. Fill of focus. Boom, right there. Rainbow unicorn. All right, so um, I bought six of them. This one's the purple guava. I've already tried it, I like it. Um, bang is kind of like, if you guys never heard of it, never seen it, Bang is kind of like um, a like monster Red Bull type of deal, but zero carbs, zero fat, zero protein, zero sugar. The ingredients list is pretty long, but never tried these, so we're gonna give it a taste test. It does have creatine, does have aminos, so a lot of people now are drinking these for pre-workouts. All right, so they're drinking these for pre-workouts, which is, which is fine. I wouldn't recommend sipping on it while you're working out. I recommend using it as like a full workout. This one can has 300 milligrams of caffeine. Wow. Okay. This one, same thing. So Bane has 300 grams of caffeine. Monsters usually have about 120 to 200-ish. So it's a lot of caffeine. So let's give it a try. All right, so first initial smell. Smells like fruit, um, lifesavers. So if you open a pack of lifesavers, that's kind of what it smells like. Like the uh, gummy lifesavers. So let's give it a try. It's already bubbling on the top. I don't know if you can see that. All Okay, it's kind of sweet, fruity, of course. Um, it kind of reminds me a lot of the Ghost products, to be honest. The Ghost supplement. It does have that after bang taste, so um, you can tell there's some artificials in there, but not bad. It tastes very, uh, very thin, like watery, but yeah, that's pretty good. So I recommend it. First time trying it. I'm glad that I got some of these. I'm gonna try it cold later on. Put these in the fridge, and yeah, I'm, I'm just excited because I've been trying to get these for a couple of weeks now. I saw them on social media, on Facebook. There's even been some influencers that have gotten these, but. Uh, now your boy finally finally got them, and they're about two dollars a can, so about the price of a uh, monster. So, all right. So just as a disclaimer, I would still say that these are okay as a drink, um, pre-workout. If you just want to drink it throughout the day, it'd be fine. Rainbow Unicorn, you would think, and as you you start drinking it, um, it's just too thin of a drink. You feel like it should be a little bit thicker, um, really watered down, but it is really sweet. Uh, it's not my favorite. I will drink it again, but there are better bangs out there. Hope you guys liked the video. Leave it a thumbs up if you got to this part. If you did like the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.